Well, we are here in uh, Lake Mineral Wells, Texas, and we've been on a ride today and yesterday, and just stopped in this beautiful lakeside place where people climb on all these cliffs and yeah. these beautiful Rock trees climbing. and flowers, and just a magnificent view. And uh, I just want to share with you today, you know, sometimes we're going through physical things, sometimes we're going through uh, something with your family or finances, you know, the, there is an enemy of God and he's your enemy and he's always attacking, trying to steal. He's a thief. He comes to steal your peace and your joy, your health. He'll, he'll take anything he can get. Mm -hmm. And so we had to fight him. We do that with faith and the way we do it is according to the word of God. So let me read you Proverbs 4. It says this, My son, attend to my words and incline thine ear unto my sayings. Let them not depart from your eyes. That means read them. Keep them in the midst of thine heart. That means uh, think about them, uh, meditate on these things. For they are life unto those that find them. If you find out what the Word of God means, it'll create life of God in you. Mm -hmm. And health or medicine to all their flesh. The Word of God is like when a doctor gives you medicine, he will tell you, he'll prescribe it to you, and he'll tell you now, it doesn't matter how bad this thing is, this pill will take care of it. Now the medicine won't do you any good if you just take it home. You can get it from the drugstore, you can take it home and put it in your medicine cabinet. But if you don't, and you can take it out and, and, and put it beside the water and hold it up near your mouth and it still won't help you at all. You can set your Bible there beside your bed yeah. or on your coffee table and it won't help you at all. But if you take that Word of God and you keep it before your eyes, Treat it like it's God talking to you, and the one who created that body will give life to it. I don't care what the devil is trying to steal from you. When you do what God tells you, those words are all words of life, and they build you up, and they are health to all your flesh. You need a new organ, the Word of God can create one. That's right. So we encourage you to stay with God's Word, and it will be a blessing to you and to your belief system, to your family, and to your life. We love you, and we'll see you tomorrow. Be healed in the name of Jesus and made whole.